Hey guys, it's Silly Cat by T here. Today, we're taking a closer look at a glitch called the Apparatus Glitch and its applications. Quick note, you must have obtained the camera rune and the memory before trying this glitch. The first and probably most useful thing is duplicating hearts. Just straighten all your hearts and stamina at the statue in Atino, then save. I buy all your hearts back and enter a shrine with an apparatus. A good choice is the Miyamagana shrine in Atino. Then perform the camera glitch on the last episode. Hold R, press L on the left joystick really fast and press A to examine the pedestal. Delete the picture and immediately hold an item, unpause, pause and watch a memory. This is the basic setup for the apparatus glitch and you should now be able to control both Link and the apparatus at the same time and you won't take damage from anything. Now reload the previous save and you'll notice that your hearts have been transferred. Other things that can transfer are champion ability counters, potion effects and the temperature. Because the new hearts are glitched, you have to trade them in before buying them back again, as they vanish after reloading. Once you reload though, the hearts will be permanent. This can be used to obtain the Master Sword early, but I will show off a more efficient technique later on. By performing the apparatus glitch, you can skip the void out cutscene by dying as you void out and healing yourself afterwards. This will allow Link to freely walk underneath, which isn't really interesting to be honest. But I can show you something that is. By doing the same steps as before, but rectaling through the void out trigger instead of falling, you get stuck in the rectaling animation. And you can't even perform every action that you can perform normally, even if there's no real animation for this. By shield jumping, you can get enough height to paraglide and HOLY SHIT WHAT THIS IS SPEED! If you perform a fall damage cancel, which can be performed by interrupting the throwing animation with switching the weapon, you'll get stuck in a state that can be called the grounded, grounded rectal lock. In this state, it's possible to use any rune to hold items, to attack and even to walk or take photos, which can look really creepy. Have you ever wanted to weigh over 5 tons until you restart the game? Well, you can by using the permanent apparatus storage glitch, which only ends after restarting the game. It's essentially doing the base setup for the apparatus glitch twice in a row and reloading before the camera zooms back out. There are three major effects. Immunity to temperature, immunity to lightnings and electricity, and the broken paraglider, which pulls Link down like a pile of potatoes. If you perform apparatus storage and then walk into lava, the temperature will be forced to update, resulting in the game to keep the death mountain effects everywhere. So don't pull out your bomb arrows unless you want to explode. Standing in water will fix the glitch though. By performing the apparatus glitch, voiding out and reloading, you'll void out as soon as the safe is loaded. This is a great way to run through shrines quickly, as you get sent to where you were safely standing on before. And it's even a great way to skip the Kushika slate. Since you void out before the game stores your coordinates, it will put you to 0, 0, 0 instead, which is underneath Hyrule Field. The game then realizes that you are outside of the Great Plateau, which places you outside the Shrine of Resurrection without Chica Slate. Let's get to the Holy Grail for every 3D Zelda game, the Early Master Sword. By saving on a horse next to it, performing the apparatus glitch and reloading, the game will get a bit confused about Link's position. Now teleport to any place you like and you'll notice that you are still in the Korok Forest, but almost everything has been unloaded. Collect the Master Sword as long as the trigger for the cutscene is unloaded and you're done. But please keep in mind, because as long as you don't get it normally, you won't have an extra slot assigned to it. By the way, water plus apparatus glitch just don't work. That's it for today. As always, thank you for watching this video. Proper credits are in the description as well as a hyperlink to the Breath of the Wild speedrunning and glitch hunting discord.